Hi, and welcome to Woody's Tapestry. Here on Woody's Tapestry, we try to put our heads together and come up with a little something, something, and today is no different. You notice in the back I got trains running? Well, there's a reason for that. See, I have a question. America, are you on the right track? Are you going in the direction that you should be going in? Better yet, are you carrying the right load? I'm reminded of a story of a young man that um, had some brothers and he had dreams. And in the dreams, it revealed that he was supposed to one day rule over his brothers. And of course, they didn't like this and they was jealous of him. So they came up with this scheme to get rid of him. But instead of getting rid of him, they put him in a position that allowed him to still be on track to his destiny. And true enough, he arrived. So he ended up being one of the main people in Egypt. And because he held this position, he was able to come back and hook up with his brothers and carry their load also. Check the story out of Joshua, Joseph. But right now, history is repeating itself. And if we're not careful in this country, we're going for some hard times, man. Really. How many of you out there understand this point? That when you tear something, both sides gets damaged. Let me repeat that. When you tear something, or when you pull it apart, both sides get damaged. Message. This is just a place to pause for the cause. But America, allow me to riddle this. It's not just what you did to your black citizens, but it's the reason that you did it. Now, I understand all of the different things that was done, the beatings, the hangings, the disfiguring, all of those things was atrocious. But scars heal. But you know what? When you have trauma for 500 years, it doesn't heal. See, when you tore us from our motherland, Africa, you didn't even know it, but you was really tearing your soul apart. Think about this. What group of men would bring their children to a place where they have abducted a guy or a woman and they decide to hang this person? Now, of course, we know they was cowards and they overpowered this person and they most likely was innocent, but they hang them anyways from a tree. Then they cut off pieces and then they stuff them in their mouth. And then after all of that, they decide, let's take pictures so we can sell it to our friends. Come on, America. But isn't this just our good old boy American history? Uh-oh, I wasn't supposed to say that. See, we're not supposed to talk about the fact that this is a part of America's history, okay? But what happened on January the 6th, 2021? America, you was off track, okay? See, America, we create our own monsters. And then we run all over the world trying to tell the world to be frightened of them. Look at King Kong, you know, big ugly thing, you know. And what was King Kong's thing that he was trying to do? He was trying to get to that white woman. See, he, he was just like Frankie. After Frankie jumped on, he was all over the countryside, you know, just scaring everybody to death. But he was chasing that woman. Message. But the thing that I'm trying to bring to you to understand about both of them is this. Frankie and King Kong were big, dark, and ugly. Now, Frankie was green. And uh, King Kong was black. And then we was tricked by the orange man. Now, if you don't believe all this happened like that, you can Google it. But this is our history. And it's crazy. See, it's crazy just like the Civil War was crazy. It's crazy just like the Cowboys and Indians. It's crazy just like slavery was crazy. And in case you don't notice, America... All of your monsters that you create are people of color. And I ask you, America, who was Frankie, King Kong, and the Indians and the Africans afraid of?
the white monster. Now, let's don't get it twisted. I'm not talking about white people. I'm talking about white monsters. Because I know a lot of good people that are white. See, I'm talking about white supremacy. See, white supremacy came in as a conductor and as an engineer, took a train, derailed it, and took it down the wrong track, hooked up all this nonsense of hate and dislike and discord, all these things that hooked up together with it. And it just go down the track, and it's been going down the track for 500 years carrying this crazy load. America, it's time to pull into the station and get on track. Okay, let me just say this to you. Hit the subscribe button that's down below. Ring my bell and don't forget to subscribe to me. And until we meet again, just remember, I love to say, logo. Here it is. Until we meet again, this is Woody's Tapestry. Peace.